Uh, excuse me, Phoenix, this is a Wendy's. What what is this? Thank you, Ariel. I really appreciate that. You're very sweet. Ariel is a good bean. Well, I thank you all for making this a nice, comfy place to hang out. I do... You know, I've, I've never had a day of the week that I just take off. Like, I don't, I don't plan for a day of the week to take off, which is probably part of many of my problems. But, um... I just find streaming very comforting, because I'm surrounded by people I like. So it's a good place to be. Thanks for the sub, Spader. Even you, Hyperstrike. Sea lioning? I don't even know what that term means. Yeah. My, uh, my, my, um, tweet deck column that catches all that stuff is always very interesting. It was especially interesting around Frame Fatals. I've heard the term uh, J-A-Q for that, just asking questions. Or more affectionately, I like to refer to it as jacking off. Well, Vera's dead, so can she really be considered guilty at this point?
So the thing I'm unclear on so far is we know that Kristoff is the bad boy. He's the naughty one. Um, but is is what's his name in on it? Is uh is Clavier in on it? Honestly, I think it's probably pretty easy to figure out who her killer was. It was definitely uh, Kristoff, and he put it in the um, fingernail polish, and so when she put it in her mouth, she died. Got it. I'm already there. Can I just get my medal for winning the court? That's a big dick penalty right there. But they often do the big dick penalties when the answer should be most obvious. So those are, I would argue, less dangerous. Okay, now can I have my medal? Can I have my medal for the court that I won? Judge is married? Oh my god. We now have more information for the lore. There's a woman who puts up with him! But she received that bottle seven years ago. This guy's laughing with three Fs. I have on many occasions considered putting soundproofing on my door. I do have soundproofing foam.
You know, for a, for a man of somewhere between the age of 24 and 65, he's very handsome. Kalaviar is better looking now. His old version from the uh, the flashback, not a good look for him, I don't think. But now, he's got the looks. Not real life 65, anime 65. Every time he looks down and his glasses, like, get that glare in them, I think he's gonna chuck a spirit bomb at me or something. Edgeworth is 100% my type. What the hell are you talking about? You have bad taste. As far as I'm concerned, Edgeworth is everybody's type. You're fine, you can post it, Divine Hero. You know the rules. Alright, Kristoff. Trucy doesn't need any more daddies, okay? Can we just be on the record at saying that she's got plenty of daddies? <laughs> That's really good. Well, okay, first off, you're definitely still responsible for poisoning your father. That's not even a question. Okay, here we go. We're doing bracelet time. This one's gonna be a tough one. I can already feel it. This one's going to be a tough one. No, I... Not... 
Hand out your penalty then, game, just because I was trying to click at the top of the screen. Thank you, Ariel. Because of the way they changed um, the browser sources, I can't hear any of my own alerts, which is a very weird thing. So it's like one word in particular. They changed the settings in a really good way, but it makes it a little bit difficult for my sound setup, so I need to play around with it and figure out a good solution. He's got a scar on the back of his hand. There it is. That was creepy. His his is creepy. know this one. <laughs> Cannot believe we just banished him to the Shadow Realm. I didn't even have to play my Pot of Greed. I rest my case. Pot of Greed allows me to draw two cards into my deck, into my hand. Sometimes when I'm having a bad day, I go back and I watch that video um, from like six months ago where they do the um, Yu-Gi-Oh! in VR. And he's like, I play Pot of Greed, which allows me to draw two cards into my hand, with which I play Pot of Greed, which allows me to play two cards into my hand. And it, and my favorite part is when it ends with, with Joey going, that does what it do, Yugi. <laughs> and I crack up every time.
Okay, I gotta, I gotta find it and play it for you really quickly. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait. I summon Pot of Greed to draw three additional cards from my deck. That's not what it does. Roll my dice. That is what it does. Pot of Greed. Draw three. I summon Pot of Greed to draw three additional oh cards God, from my deck. And I summon Pot of Greed to draw three additional cards from my deck. Then I play Magic Force, which allows me to play Pot of Greed once again to draw three additional <laughs> cards from my deck. You know, he's right. And I attack and I win, right? No. You don't have any, well, you don't have any monsters. And oh, monsters he's supposed to be here. Have... What? Oh, you got the Celtic God. <laughs> My, My turn! I summon Dark Magi I... Magician! <laughs> I also <laughs> summon Jack's Knight! What? How? You can't what summon you a doing? bunch of cards on one turn. It's against the rules. You never saw this coming! I what summon Pot of Green to draw three additional <laughs> cards from my deck! That's what? not what it does! <laughs> Doesn't that do is that. what it does! <laughs> does it, I that's, what, that's what it do, you <laughs> mean! That does what it do! That does what it do. <laughs> ah! I love that so much. <laughs> Doesn't Pi have a greed emote? I had a pot of greed emote. What the hell happened to it? Did it get removed? I uh, probably swapped it out for another emote at some point. Bummer. There are Ace Attorney runs? Absolutely. You can speedrun any sort of bad idea. Whose emote is that? Where did that even come from? JJ Aura, thank you for sharing that with us. Jesus, Liz. Those are some good emotes. Are those public emotes? Everyone has them? No, I don't have them. I'm jealous. Oh, you had to sub during it, and then you just got them forever? That would have been worth it. But the letter specifically said to use the stamp. Oh my god. Why do I have to rehash every part of this damn case?
I'm jealous of you, JJ Orr. You win this round. I can't believe you just summoned the all the pieces of the sacred god Exodia. Exactly, bad actor. That's what I'm getting at. For some reason, that does what it do is hilarious as a line on its own. You added to my tweet. <laughs> Thank you. I'm, I think I'm on board with everyone's theory that Kristoff probably pronounced it Eustace. He probably pronounces it Apollo Eustace. I believe that. Clavier doesn't get to pick the punishments. This is... <clears throat> does the... Does the forged evidence say on it that it was commissioned by him? It doesn't say on there. I mean, wasn't it this? It was commissioned by Kristoff? Oh, I'm gonna get fucked by this. I'm gonna get fucked.
Zoomers are the modern term for Generation Z. Smartball, next time I have you on a call, I'm going to make you say, that does what it do, Yugi, in uh, your New Jersey accent. You've got the accent too, Maddie. Well, then you have uh, a direct vein to comedy right there. Ooh, boo Bob, that sucks. I'm sorry. Plan he'll be dead by the time the rest of us go. Yeah, I'm a millennial as well. 87 over here. Nice. We've talked about this before, Amy. That's a good attitude, Ariel. Whoa. I'm sorry, we are we out here getting Phoenix uh getting him uh 
Getting his badge back? Is it gonna be Kristoff? Is it gonna be Kristoff? It's gonna be Kristoff. It's gonna be Kristoff. He'd have to retake the bar exam. Ooh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Let me begin by saying, y'all wrong. Y'all wrong for this one. Y'all straight up wrong for this. Uh, you know, if this is how... If this is how Judge lets people walk all over him in his courtroom, he must be very submissive in his relationship. You think this is the right time? It's not. I know it's in this envelope, but you know, what if now were the right time? What did I do wrong? I'm just saying, he seems very submissive. We found out he's married. I'm sorry, I take it all back. The purpose of my content has always been to entertain. 
I'm sorry for all of the people if you feel offended. And I am monetizing this apology video. Is it this? Because, well, okay, yeah, it was uh, in his cell. Sure, it's got to be that. It took me a really long time to arrive at the very obvious right answer. Objection. That evidence was acquired illegally. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops, that's not ideal. Uh-oh. That's not great. Yeah, you do. Use your boot on him. Kick him in the mouth. No, it's only a conspiracy to commit crime, not an actual crime. Very different. All right, Clavier is on my team. I support him wholeheartedly. We are Team Clavier now. Everyone start making your posters.
<laughs> I couldn't forget what was important to me. Punching this wall. It's always been what's important to me. I took this job because they said, if you take this job, you can punch this wall. Almost as if Kristoff had tipped him off. known that Kristoff was scum. Man, he's really mad at that wall. No, you, Kristoff. Okay, Apollo, why don't you go back to just chilling out in the background for a second? Uh, we're having a family meeting. No, you missed the forest. Okay, all right. We we are we know you're still here. Don't worry about it. Apollo's literally over there like, nobody's paying attention to me! Yikes. I 
Hey, just a quick question. Does Do future games feature this many daddies? I just, uh, asking for a friend. Friend who wants to have a game with fewer daddies. I mean, you're not making yourself sound less guilty, my man. Uh-oh, Trucy's about to find out some news. Trucy's holding it together okay. All right, let's go. Yeah, what Trucy doesn't know is that she's Apollo's sister. What an evil man. Oh, this is kind of sad though. I think what's gonna, I think what we're gonna find out is that she spent all those years not using the nail polish because she believed it was her good luck charm. And after talking to Phoenix a few days ago, it finally dispelled the magic, so she finally used the nail polish, and that's how she died. So, indirectly and inadvertently, Phoenix is partly responsible. That's the saddest thing. <laughs> Oh, 
Uh, yeah, she might still be alive. If you're done. A lot of objections going on. Objection. objection. You can't object, you're the witness. Witness can't yell objection, I'm pretty sure. Maybe, I don't know, I'm not a lawyer. It's Jeff here. Jeff is also probably very tired of having to answer every stupid question that pops into my head about lawyer stuff. We forgot all about the jurists. Not winning a lot of jurist favor, my friend. <laughs> Yikes. I'd say something nice about the common citizens real quick. Like, boy, do those common citizens sure bathe regularly. <laughs> yeah. Well, he already said that. He called them mouth breathers.
<laughs> Kristoff is pissed. <laughs> Uh oh, he's going Super Saiyan. <laughs> yep, he went Super Saiyan. I was right. Hey friend, this is the end of your game, by the way. If you don't figure out what law is real soon, <laughs> we might be done here. <laughs> I just want him to, like, <laughs> go out of his brain for a second and be... And say, like, Judge, what is law? And just... Just see what Judge says, you know? Who's, hey y'all, who do you think is jurist number six? Was that Lamoror? Also, why do I get to select? Oh no! But I think she's not guilty. But what if this is setting me up? Okay, I'm gonna save here because I wanna know what happens if I pick the other option. Okay, not guilty because she didn't do it. <gasps> it 
was her. It was it was Apollo's mom. Wait, was was that actually Lamoror? And was she wearing a bracelet the whole goddamn game? And I just didn't notice it? Aww. I love Vera so much. My favorite part about this last case was the fact that I did not have to provide any decisive evidence. At the end, I just got to pronounce myself successful. She drew his idiot hair, his ahoge. Is that it? I've forgotten it. I haven't said it in a while. Ahoge? Same thing, Ariel. Oh, I was going to load the save state and we were going to see it. We may still do that, though. But that's good to know. Oh, it's not a big deal, Bob. It's not like it's a... It's not like it's a... Uh, I mean, it's like a minor plot thing, but... That doesn't bother me.
I mean, it seems relatively obvious that whatever I do, if I do the opposite thing, no matter what, I lose, right? We're not talking about that anymore. Move on. Phoenix is such a nice guy. That's what love is. Sometimes being annoyed by people, but still wanting to be around them. Or Trucy. The guillotine for cigars. That's kind of sweet. I feel like the games have, um, since the first one, gone slightly downhill in the way that they do sort of the wrap-up VN section. It, or rather, it just gets briefer and briefer. Though I guess this game didn't really need a big wrap-up because you kind of explain a great deal of the quote-unquote ending in the, um in the Mason section. Yeah, stick around for a few minutes after this, after the credits are done, 
uh, will watch the bad ending. I'm glad you asked, Bob. Uh, what's next? Um, so, Professor Layton Crossover is definitely the next of the Professor Layton games I'm going to play, but I think I might take just a little bit of a break off of these. Uh, not as long as last time I took a break. Last time I took a break, it was for like a month. Um, but I'll probably take a week or two off of this. Uh, give me some time to focus on my AGDQ submissions and stuff. Um, also, I'm considering doing a casual playthrough of Yoshi's Island 100% because I've never played Yoshi's Island and I've been wanting to, so... Yes, the 3D Ace Attorney games are happening. The Great Ace Attorney spin-offs are happening. Um, the Layton crossover is happening. I mean, it's taken us how long to get here, right? Uh, hold on, let me pull up the, the playlist. It's taken us how long to get here? When was the first video in that published? Uh, October 20th, 2018. Really? October 20th, 2018? It's only taken us a year to get here? What? That doesn't sound right. No, the phase don't even appear in this one. Phoenix is pretty much the only returning character. Feels like it's been a lot longer. Anyway, we're probably looking at it being like a year plus for me to finish the rest of the games. There's still a lot to go. Hey, it's Marlon Brando again. Big wins. They got phased out. I hate it. Well, I mean, I love it, but I'm contractually obligated to hate all puns. I hate Walkie so much. I never liked him. Though his name is Walkie Kataki, which is a good... A good name. I really liked the final case. No questions. I really liked it. I, I felt like people were setting me up to not like Apollo Justice, but I thought this game was really good. I think I might have ended up liking this game a little more if Phoenix hadn't been this sort of weird hobo character. That It was just unexplained why he was in such a shabby state for so long. I get it. I mean, it all makes sense in the end, but... Oh, Boyks has a whole uh, Hobo Phoenix cosplay, too.
Yeah, I think that's possibly true. I think it maybe doesn't necessarily fit Phoenix as well, but it fits a grown-up ideal of Phoenix well, so I think that's okay. Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Looking forward to it for you, Amy. I will be streaming all of them, broadcasting every one of them. I've been loving the Ace Attorney content, and as long as you guys continue watching it, I will continue streaming it. I am I love these games so much. Even if you guys stop watching it, I'd probably still stream them, to be honest. I think Vera was my favorite. I like her so much. She's so, she's so cute and so sweet. As far as the witnesses go, Trucy's pretty good too. Kay is still the best partner. Hands hands down, Kay is still the best partner. Fight me on this. Trucy is Trucy is good and I love her. But K is still the best. Alright, bad ending time. Later, Amy. That's it. That's the whole thing.